Um, it is Saturday and um, we're gonna have some people over later um, it's really late in the morning it's like 8 something so I need to get up get some studying done and then um, get ready for people we're gonna have fajitas it's gonna be fun mommy this is Spongebob Squarepants Pianta I'm gonna get you the wet food so you can give her a little bit of it. So we decided to name the kitty Chloe. She's of Tessa. Instead of Tessa, her name is Chloe. Mm -hmm. she's, she's pretty fun. She's pretty entertaining. We thought she was calm. She was going to be a calm cat. Mm -hmm. and she looks like she was acting like she was a calm cat. She was just playing the act, huh? Mm -hmm. She's super fun, super active, and really funny. She... And I like pets like that. Yeah. Like so. Why do you say like so? Like so. <laughs> and then right here. Oh, you grab the you pointy it. part and yeah. brush it like that. Yeah, just like that. Uh, going to do it in front of the camera. Okay, do it in front of the camera. Yeah, the people want to see yeah. how you shred queso fresco. Mm -hmm. okay, so what if some people want to like make it? What if some people want to make it? Hey guys, so it has been a minute since I have done a living room tour and I know I've been saying I'm going to do a living room tour, um, but it has been really crazy and I'm still working on some things but I thought I would show you what it looks like because it looks really different compared to how it looked last year around this time. My husband and I have been working really hard just to do subtle things, little things here and there, inexpensive fixes and stuff like that. So I wanted to show you what it looked like and then I hear somebody, they're hiding. 
So I wanted to show you really quick what it, or really quickly what it looked like. We're gonna have some people over, so um, I haven't really got a chance to clean clean, and the kids are home and the hubby's here. So let's just do a quick room or living room tour. I'm not showing you the kitchen because it's kind of a mess. We just finished like washing a bunch of dishes. Right, so in here is the the Mia. <laughs> So in here is my like eating kitchen area. And what's different in here is that I painted these chairs. They were like a light wood color. And now they are um, like a mushroom gray color, I think is what it's called. And then a white color. It's supposed to be like a whitish gray color, I think. Um, I'm trying to remember what color. I think I mixed two colors actually together. Like, a really light gray color and a white color. I was hoping it would be a little bit more gray, but it looks white. But, um, I like it. You like it? So, this is the eating kitchen area. Here is a look of the entire living room. Here is an overview of the entire living room. And so, if you watched before, um, the couch used to be right here, right here, and then there was another love seat right here, and then where that picture was was where the TV was at with um, a shelf like this, and this blank in each side, and then an entertainment center. So we, my husband and I, um, you can see the little hole right there, we still need to patch it up, but my husband and I mounted the TV, and it's got, got like a swivel mount so I can pull it all the way out if I need to and I can watch it from the kitchen. Oh, there's my dirty kitchen. Those are wash dishes. But yeah, I have my dog's bed here because she's got to be comfy. And then this little... We had to, to like move everything because like there wasn't like that enough space like for the dog bed to be... Yeah, there just wasn't enough yeah. space for all of us and the kids are getting bigger so... And to walk around. And to walk around. So this made the house feel, or the living room feel so much bigger. And I'm really excited about it. I really want to do the same thing to my other living room. Um, like the more formal living room, even though it's not, it's like a homeschool room, but I want to open it up. So this little stand thing is from Target. Um, I don't know if they have any more, but um, I will try to find something and link it down below. And the dog bed is from Costco. It's really nice and really plush. And me and Dashi almost took it. <laughs> And so we're still working on hiding some of the wires, like the cable wire, the way it was ran. We couldn't, I didn't feel like putting another hole in the wall and putting like multiple holes in the wall. So I'm gonna find some way to make that like less obvious. And then we just got, um, I've been trying to minimalize things. And so I've been decorating the house with plants. So I just got this plant from Lowe's, no, sorry, Home Depot, and I needed to get a thing for it. Lily has not messed with it, surprisingly. But she only has to She'll try to mess with this one, but she's usually pretty good about because not messing with it. Because it's just like a teeth mark right yeah. there. So, but usually she's pretty good about not messing with it. But um, the sofa is from Gallery Furniture. It's the same sofa I had last time. And then the pillows are from Ikea. And so I like, because if you see right here, if you look closely, there's like a stain right here I from the it kids. Ikea. Mike. <laughs> there's it's a, Minecraft Ikea. <laughs> there's a um, stain right here from the kids spilling something, so I can just take the covers off and wash them. And is then- it, These are covers? Yeah, they're pillow covers. Mia, go fix your hair for me, please. Are these Ikea pillow covers are really expensive, like the black and white ones, I think they're like $5 each. So I just feel like with kids, it makes more sense to have things that you could take off and wash easily. Um, this picture frame is not gonna stay here, but it is there because it is hiding from when the old owners used to have um, um, their TV hung there. Let's see, can you see it? Uh, but this is pretty much the overview of everything. Um, like I said, everybody's home, so I've been procrastinating doing this because like the kids are home or whatever, but um, the house was kind of cleaned for guests. But yeah, I hope you guys like it. And I mean, we're, we're planning to do some other things with it. Um, and so whenever we do that, you can see the change. One of the things I'm thinking about getting is like a sectional that goes all the way into that corner and all the way out because my kids are so big. And so we have a hard time 
fitting all of us on the sofas. But yeah. Jassi has no idea where else to go. <laughs> oh. That looks yummy. I got a macaroon. You got a macaroon? Mm -hmm. That sounds delicious. It is. It is. You have any? Ah! It just, I didn't realize it was raining. We just stopped and got some kung fu tea. Mia's getting ready to go to a birthday party. And I got macaroon. She got a macaroon. And then I got milk. Mia got a strawberry milk slushie. And then Renee got a grapefruit kung fu tea. It's pretty delicious. He gets his without boba. I get mine with boba because I like. <laughs> I like it. So let's see if we can do this. I can never do this. Let's see. Oh shit! Oh! Explosion! Explosion! <laughs> <laughs> um. Come on! Come in! Come in! <laughs> Give me my drink. So I'm about to. Oh, you're so mean. Um, we're about to go to Mia's friend's birthday party, and so we were a little bit early, so we just went and stopped and got some green tea. I didn't record very much yesterday because I totally forgot. <laughs> I'm an amateur. <laughs> you know, amateur mistake, amateur mistake. But I'm gonna stop recording because it messes with Renee when he's driving. Gymnastics? Yeah, she comes to gymnastics here. Oh my gosh! Look at him! That's amazing! I'm not kidding! We're about to work out. My workout buddy. We're about to get it. I don't even know if I'm on. Um, I've got a lot of new subscribers coming to the channel and I really appreciate it and welcome and thank you guys to the ones that have supported me from day one. Slowly and steadily my channel is growing and I really appreciate it. If you liked this video, comment down below or give it a like. Let me know what you'd like to see in the future. I'm not sure if you guys like the weekend vlogs, so if you do, let me know if I should compute if I should continue them, like comment down below, say yes, or give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down if you don't think I should continue it. But ultimately, I want to be able to put content up that you guys are going to be enjoying. So if you like that, just let me know. And I will see you guys in the next one because I'm about to go watch some Walking Dead. I'm going to find everybody and I think they're hiding from me, trying to scare me.